Hydroelectricity versus coal. Where is it used? Which one is more efficient? What job opportunities are there? This presentation will provide some of the answers. Hydropower is the most important and widely used renewable source of energy globally. It represents about 16% of total electricity produ production. China is the largest producer, followed by Canada, Brazil, and the United States. As of 2013, coal, a non-renewable source, provides approximately 41% of the world's electricity needs. The key coal exporting countries are Indonesia, Australia, Russia, South Africa, Colombia, and the United States. They support 90% of the world's coal. Coal fire power plants are found in over 40 countries. Hydroelectricity power plants are very expensive to build. One plant in Brazil cost $20 billion and took 18 years to build. Coal-fired plant power plants are less expensive. One plant in the United States was estimated to cost between two and three million dollars. To make it easier to compare the costs of different kinds of energy production, economists use levelized energy costs, which include all the costs such as initial cap capital, continuous operation, fuel, and maintenance, as well as the time to build power plant. This table shows the different costs per kilowatt hour for each kind of power plant. Coal costs 11 US cents, but hydro only costs a little more than six cents. Hydroelectricity power generation is the most efficient method of large scale electric power generation. The kinetic energy of the water is converted by the turbines directly into electric energy. There is no intermediate process that allows heat loss. The efficiency can therefore be as high as 95%. Coal-fired power generation is not very efficient because the energy must be converted many times before it becomes electricity. First the coal is burned, which heats water, which makes steam, which then turns the turbine that makes electricity. There is a lot of heat lost in the process. These plants operate on the thermodynamic Rankine system. Overall, efficiency ranges from 32% to 42%. One job in the area of hydroelectricity is an engineer who would design and construct the plants. This engineer would need to have expertise in hydrotechnical design, hydrological analysis, and energy and economic evaluations. An engineer needs to have an undergraduate university degree, and maybe a master's degree and a professional registration. Coal-fired power needs many coal miners. Depending on the country, there are different regulations. In the United States, high school graduates can work as coal miners after 40 hours of training, followed by apprenticeship to an experienced miner. Miners eventually get certified as a general coal miner. Both are major global sources of electricity. Both provide jobs to hundreds of thousands of people. From the perspective of efficiency, hydropower is far more beneficial.